how's everyone doing today? I'm feeling pretty well, but I'm a bit anxious today. Around self-harm, there's still a lot of stigma and that can be quite isolating for young people. So having peer support at WISH means that young people can talk in a space where they won't be judged and they can support each other freely and that can be, the groups can be a lifeline for many young people. Peer support group meets, it really depends on when people need it, but roughly every two weeks to once a month and in it, we do check-ins with each other, find out how each other's feeling. So we talk about um, one good thing in our week and one bad thing in our week. And we also have time to talk to each other privately. And it gives you the chance to share your experiences with people the same age as you and people that understand what you're going through. It helps to have people similar ages understanding what you're going through um, so that you feel less alone. Peer support was very helpful for me. I been able to communicate and open myself to the other people. I started to trust more. I started to talk more because before it was really difficult for me. I felt people, I started to feel myself through that atmosphere, positivity and smiles. I, I just wanted to stay there. I just wanted to continue to communicate with people. I really loved it and it helped me so much to overcome my sense of loneliness. I just so much appreciate the peer support sessions. I've had therapy and counselling before WISH, but I think that it's really been different for me. This has been a really long um, therapy period that has really helped me to get through the really difficult year during the pandemic and at the end of my A-levels and beginning university because everything was virtual I was able to continue during my first term of university and it's been really great because I have been able to understand where my triggers come from, where everything stems from I think and build a clearer vision of my past and my future and it, it just I think it definitely offered a lot of clarity as well as support like just knowing that there's always somebody there once a week who you can talk about everything with and can be there for you. We deal with a lot of issues related to self-harm. We can support young people through um, depressive episodes, um, anxiety, stress around school, lots of different things. Therapy was really helpful for me because I've been able to overcome my pain, face it and become much more stronger and braver. It was really helpful to find out who I am and how I can cope with my difficult situations. It really did change me inside and give me more power. Some of our young people choose to get involved in volunteering at WISH. It gives them a voice to share their story and that can be really empowering. I've been volunteering for WISH and I found that it's helped grow my confidence and it's given me the opportunity to give back to the community. So I took part in a young people's conference about mental health and I was able to talk on a panel from a young person's perspective of mental health and also I was in a campaign at Christmas to help fundraise for WISH and I found it really helpful because it's allowed me to find a voice and share my experience but also ensure that other young people feel they can talk about this kind of thing. Uh, we've been doing yoga sessions and hit sessions and I basically started to practice yoga after after we've been practicing with uh, with a trainer I do struggle with anxiety and I found yoga really helpful for me to practice even on my own so I'm really thankful for the sports sessions that they pushed me forward in this activity so it was really helpful for me to push me forward and continue to beat up my bad feelings, my bad states. Wish has definitely helped me have a more in-depth understanding of myself 
and my behavioural patterns, um, where they come from historically. And that self-awareness has helped me build a lot of resilience and em empathy for myself, definitely. Thank you.